good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. Ma'am, I think we had this conversation. Look, look at, you're finding all, like, you're literally getting all the toys out. Are you just going through them, figuring out which ones you don't want to play with anymore, and then the rest of them we can donate? Maybe give them to Miss Indy and Miss Lana? You look exhausted. Was you playing with toys all night last night and all morning again this morning, huh? Where's Miss Memphis? Look at, look at Miss Memphis. Is like, I got nowhere to lay, so I'm gonna lay over here on the floor. Are you sleeping? Oh, biggest stretch ever. Good stretch. Hey, girl. What's up? She's like, there's dog toys everywhere. They're everywhere. All right, as long as you're playing with them, you don't have to pick them up, but you're not really playing with them right now. You're kind of napping. You're kind of friggin' adorable right now, too. She's like, I've been playing all morning. What do you expect from me? <laughs> Did I just catch you digging? Look at me. Hey, Memphis. Memphis says, oh, I would never, I would never dig that hole. Did you dig that hole? <gasps> Are you guys digging holes in dad's new grass? Oh my goodness. You know, we just got this grass to grow. Now you can't dig the holes here. Go dig the holes in the back where you're supposed to. Memphis, you can't dig a hole there. She's like, oh, so, hey, stop it. You do, knock it off. <laughs> Crazy pups. Hey, are you gonna be good? Cause I gotta leave for a couple hours. Do you wanna tell the vlog what's going on? Say so guys, mom's gotta leave for a few hours to take Greg to pick up a car. Yeah, so we got a little story for you. So I'm on my way to go pick up Greg and take him over to Traverse City to pick up a car because a couple of nights ago, Greg was in a car accident. He's okay. We'll insert some photos so you guys can see. Uh, he came around a hill, came around a corner on a hill, hit some black ice and lost control of his car. Uh, again, he's he's okay. He's okay, you guys. He's okay. But the Jeep was totaled, so he needs a new car. Well, a new used car. So we found one over in Traverse City, and he asked me if I would take him over there to go pick it up. So I'm going to go pick him up. Him and I are going to drive to Traverse City and possibly pick up this car for him. So you guys will see him in a minute. Are you going to pick up Kira's toys while I'm gone? What was that? She says, no, I'm not, because I didn't make this mess. But you were digging... I saw you digging in that hole. It's okay. <laughs> if there's time, maybe I'll run and get you something special from the pet store in Traverse City. What do you think? Go to PetSmart in Traverse City? She's like, I want to go to PetSmart with you. No, you got to stay here with Dad. Keep Dad company. I'll be back in a little bit. Trying this trick come on. to get Kira to come inside. Come on, let's go inside. Dad's got her favorite toy in the world. I don't know, Dad. Oh, oh my God, favorite toy ever. It worked. <laughs> She's like, now you gotta come in here and play with it with me though. Yes, yes, yes. See, if you picked up your toys, you wouldn't land on all of them. She's like, don't care. This is amazing. <laughs> she just runs around you in circles. Good jump. Favorite toy ever, huh? I think Memphis, the look on Memphis's face, I like, her a little. oh, did you get bopped in the face? Yeah. The other day I was playing with this toy with her and Memphis got super excited and started to play with Kira. I'm like, with what? Kira? Yeah. I'm like, oh, okay. All right. What do you think, Memphis? Memphis is so concerned. She's like, I know you're, oh, did she push you? Push her back. Whoa. I almost got hit with the toy. Favoritist toy on the planet. I love how Memphis thinks about it when it gets close to her. She's like, mm, maybe. Ew, you just drooled everywhere. Whoa, did she get you, Memphis? You just like watching her play, don't you? She's like, sometimes I join in. Most of the time I don't. All right, I'm going to go take Mr. Greg to get a new car so he has transportation again. No, yeah. more, no more Jeep for Greg. Yeah. <gasps> He's no longer a member of the Red Jeep Club. Yeah. Well, we can't be friends with him anymore. <laughs> his vehicle is four-wheel drive, so... Yeah. He'd still be in the four-by-four four club. Yeah, he could be. Except his Jeep only has three wheels on it now. Yeah. <laughs> oh. All right, you girls have fun. And boy. And I'll be back. Good jump. I'll be back later. <laughs> so here's what's left of the Jeep. All the windows on this side busted out, the back window busted out. 
that tire came off and it was actually under the truck that I hit. That's all smashed up. This door is where I hit. That's how I broke my ribs. And then the back end is pretty smashed up. I can't get this this back open. This door opened, and when I opened this door the first time, it wouldn't close. So I think I twisted the frame a bit as well. Look, we made it to the dealership. Yeah, I don't know where the car is though. And look, I'm not lying. Greg's alive. I'm alive. I'm fine. He's okay. Mostly. You know, your glasses are broke, but you yeah, know. Yeah, so I got my old glasses. These glasses are broke as well. They are. <laughs> I, I'm trying to guess from when I bought these. I think these are like eight years old. Really? These glasses are old. Hmm. These are the ones I bust out when my glasses break. Uh, right. These aren't at, they're about to snap. That's why. <laughs> so we're at the dealership. We're going to go look at a car for Greg. Yeah. Hey, you can drive it home. Hopefully. Yay. All right, let's go I'm do this. It's everything I want it to be. It will be. Let's do this. Let's go buy it. Ooh, we're test driving the car. So it's, what is it? A Subaru Outback? Subaru Outback. All right. So this is a stick. Greg has not driven a stick in a very long time. So they told us to come back here and uh, drive it around here. This is kind of cool. <laughs> we can go to Lowe's. Sounds like a car. Drives like a car. I don't know anything about cars. So I, do, I know a little bit. I can tell by the sounds what's... Mm, sounds I'm like a car. I'm pretty sure there's a small exhaust leak. And little yeah, like yeah. Well, I mean, you got to expect it's a, that. It's a 2003. Yeah. So, yeah, nothing super fancy, but hey, your Jeep wasn't super fancy either. I don't need super fancy. You fans. definitely could camp back here. I could probably camp too back there if I put those seats yeah, down. Yeah, I think so. I think you could. No. Mom and Greg went to Traverse City to get Greg a new car. Puppy, I think you were asked, oh yeah, you're just going to yawn, clean up your mess. And you did not clean up your mess. I'm watching TV, I've got, I've got Memphis right here with me and they're both waiting for their dinner. Can I please have dinner? Oh yeah, big yawn. You? You're like, uh, you can keep patting me, please. Thank you. Well, Greg's not sitting next to me. He's behind me in his Subaru Outback that he bought. And now we're trying to make our way out of this chaos of Traverse City. Look, it's Greg's car! So we stopped to fill up for gas, but I thought I'd show you guys real quick. That's Greg's car. Greg, you got a new car. <laughs> we are trying to get the heck out of here because it's dark and it's busy and it's Traverse City. So he's, uh, He's gonna pump gas and we're gonna hit the road. All right, we made it home. There's the Jeep. I bet your new car drives better than that thing does. Oh, I made it back! Oh no, it trapped on the other side of the gate. You're gonna smell kitties on me though. That was a five hour round trip, huh? Do you smell, do you smell the kitties? Do you smell them? Do you smell the kitties? Yeah, I figured you'd be more interested in the fact that I smell like kitties than the fact that I was home. I, oh, I didn't film the kitties. I should have. I pet all of Greg's cats. <laughs> all of them. Mr. Oh, Mr. Pickles and Weechi and Chewy and I can't remember all their names. <laughs> but yeah, I did. I pet them all. And I got to see Mr. Pickles' house. It was dark though. What do you think? Yay, I'm home. I'm home. Greg has a new car. Yeah. He says he'll probably come over and show it to you tomorrow. Dogs were good? And pick up the room. Oh, <gasps> Kira! I told him a couple times. You're gonna be grounded, young lady. I told you to pick up your toys. He's like, yeah, well, <laughs> too bad. I'm not doing it. How come you didn't pick up her toys? Mom, I didn't make that mess. I don't have to clean it up. You're right. You didn't make it. You don't have to clean it up. Oh, I only had to slam on the brakes once for the deer that ran out in front of me. Deer. Out of the whole trip. One, well, three deer ran out in front of me, but at oh, one time. Of course, it was probably in the dark. Oh, well, yeah, it was in the dark. <laughs> yeah, it was in the dark on a road I didn't really know, so. Yeah. But we, we survived. What? All right, I'll come snuggle you. Look, it's the next morning, and she still didn't pick up her toys. She's outside chasing squirrel friend. What do you think? She's like, I ain't picking up dumb toys. It's not my mess. All right, you guys, that is all we have for today's video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I forgot what I was saying. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Say goodnight, partyers. You don't get to drink dad's coffee even though you think you do. Boop. You don't like dumb boops. <laughs>